an ally. So to escape, we're gonna need somebody inside the penitentiary to help us. But who? Mm -hmm. Our ticket out! But why would she help us? Maybe if she was in love with us. <laughs> oh, exactly. We'll seduce her. That's gonna be tricky. I'm willing to sacrifice myself. I'll do it. No, I'll do it. Out of the question. I should be the one to do it. I have nicer proportions than you. <laughs> Hello, boys. You dropped your handkerchief. Now let's show her what an athlete I am. Joe, that's a good thing. In this book, they say that in order to seduce a woman, you have to make a laugh. Huh? May I help you carry this picnic basket? That's very kind of you. After you. Very welcome. She's not in love enough. We need a new plan. Says here that women love bad boys, that they makes them crazy. I'm, I'm a, a bad, bad boy. boy. Well, is there anyone else who would like to seduce her? <laughs> A stroll? Oh, listen. Do you hear a herd of buffaloes approaching? Walk with me! <laughs> Say something to her. You have to talk about her and make compliments. Take your hand! They're abandoning me! It was all his scheme to lose me in the desert! Hey, don't give up, Joe! You can do it! You just hit a rough patch! It's worth it if we escape! Ah, yes, the escape! Tell me what I need to do! Learn this by heart. Your eyes are like... Raspberries. No, your lips are like raspberries. Your eyes are blue and deep as... Raspberries? No, as the ocean, Joe. The ocean. It's no rocket science, Joe. Your lips are as blue as the raspberries in your eyes. Ah, nope. What was it again? Hey, Miss Betty! Huh? Your lips are like mountain lakes in which... Joe, you think you love me, but it's just an illusion. 
And I don't love you anyway. Why? What's wrong with me? Hmm? Ah! Yeah, I was passing by and I saw everything. The tall blonde is rejecting you. Make her drink this potion. The small and clumsy ones have to help each other. Wow, that is quite something. <laughs> yes? Huh? Oh, Miss Betty, can I offer you this cocktail? Oh, thank you. Delicious. A bit better, but delicious. Okay, should we kiss first or run away? Are you crazy? I would never have such relations with a convict. Don't feel bad, Joe. There is someone for you in this world. Yes, a teeny tiny Mrs. Joe Dalton. Yep, as ugly and as clumsy as you are. <laughs> Oh, love is so beautiful. Wow, this sounds cool. Hurry and find the keys. <laughs> Quiet! The guards will hear us! <laughs> Cut it out, Averell! No! Someone keeps turning on the alarm every time I hit this button! <laughs> Lock them up this time with the ball and chains. <laughs> Avril, next time, remind me to escape without you. Six foot athletic bell, 20 something Italian prince seeks unattached supermodel who appreciates being pampered. The director put a personal ad in the paper. <laughs> this was on his desk. <laughs> this gives me an idea. Uh, Mr. Director, sir, a visitor for you. In reference to your ad. <laughs> Peabody, Melvin Peabody, prison director. And you're... Eh, Samantha! Samantha Big Bottom! <laughs> Something about you reminds me of the Daltons. The Daltons? The famous outlaws? I'm a big fan, especially that Jew. You mean the little ugly one? Mm. No, the little handsome one. <laughs> oh, let me give you a hand with that. Keep your hands to yourself. The Wild West is a scary place at night. You'd better sleep in this room, right next to mine. <laughs> the old Melvin charm is working its magic. Hey! Joe, hurry back, you're gonna miss the head girl. Ooh. Everything okay, Samantha? Tomorrow, Samantha has a dinner date with Peabody, and the four of us are gonna be the waiters. Don't you see? 
This is a great chance for us to escape. Just us four, alone with a warden and his girlfriend. Uh, you and Samantha there at the same time? I didn't think about that. Looks like she's late, which means she's right on time. Only three guys come out? Come on, come on, I know you're in there. Ah, my love, here at last. Uh, <clears throat> but, uh, where's Joe? <laughs> Are you trying to make me jealous? I thought I was the one you were interested in. <laughs> My goodness, what a pleasure to be in the company of a lady of such distinction and class. Goodness has nothing to do with it! What do you say we go for a midnight stroll? Just you and me and the moon. <laughs> Don't worry, I am armed. <laughs> You can run, but you can't hide. I will hunt you down wherever you go. Hey, do you hear something? Look, a shooting star. Time for a wish. Mine first. Ladies first! Hands up, Peabody! Samantha, what's going on? Ah! Ah! It's Marie Antoinette! Ah, are you stupid, but let me go! Ow! Move! We're out of here! Samantha! Samantha, come back! Oh, dang! I broke a heel! So you're an outlaw. I run a prison. It's a marriage made in heaven. Love conquers all. You still don't get it. I'm not Samantha. I'm Joe, Joe Dalton, I'm a boy! Well, that's okay. Nobody's perfect. Oh. Joe Dalton is a woman? Nobody move! Okay, Daltons, we're going home. I always said you had a feminine side, Joe. And I always said even a girl could kick your behind. Atmosphere of friendship and hard work. Ah, oh, Miss Betty, our little sunshine. New convict. Only one. His name's Louise. <laughs> oh. Hello, my name's Lou. <gasps> I need a director. I'm, um... And what's the director's name? Mr. Peabody. <laughs> but you can call me George. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay, I say. Excuse me. <gasps> nothing, nothing, Miss Coyote. Not Coyote, Lou. Bags, hat, hole, Doug, civilian clothing, Jack. We're good to go, Joe. Yo, Joe. Joe, are we going? No, we're uh -huh. staying. Broke a nail. Uh, please, let me. <laughs> That's enough! Everyone to the kitchen for potato duty. <laughs> May I? <laughs> I love exercising once in a while. Mmm. How impressive. <laughs> what strong muscles you have. <laughs> that must have been a mistake with your file. We only take men in 
here. I really don't mind. I like men, don't you? Oh, he's so cute. Where are your parents? What's your name? Uh, Joe. Joe Dalton. Joe Dalton. Pleased to meet you. <laughs> you know, I don't mind a small fellow. Oh, you're so strong, Joe. I'm impressed. Hey, Joe, you're so smart. You must have a plan to escape. It's just... We're full. Of course, if you'd rather stay with your boyfriends. But it's them or me. Hey, Joe, when are we escaping? Later. Continue without me. I'll go get some air. Genius, Joe. What are we having lunch? Uh, uh -oh. You know, I don't mind a small fellow. Uh. Uh. Joe, let's get out of here, just uh. you and me, and live together. Yeah, but what about my brothers? They're big boys. You need to think about yourself, about us, just the two of us. Just you and me. You know, I see right through your little game. A game? I don't know what you're talking about. Anyway, we're hmm. transferring you tomorrow. Bye-bye, Coyote. Transfer me? Joe, you gotta free us tonight. Uh, uh, okay. Mom! <laughs> and once we're far away, we get your loot back and we run away to Europe. My loot? What loot? I don't have loot. You're my only treasure. What? No loot? Oh! oh. The exit! <laughs> It's the girl! A girl? What girl? Oh. Sorry, Joe. But you're staying. But Lou, you said we'd live in love and fresh water. I'd rather live in luxury and fresh cash. Joe, mm -hmm. you were escaping without us? Where's the girl? Uh, not at all. <laughs> it's a plan. Help me up quick. A plan? Yeah, right. You can't do this to me! Um, yes. I was right! Your name is in fact Coyote. I was sure that if you knew you'd be transferred tomorrow, you'd escape tonight. So I'm not transferring anymore? Escape attempt? You're leaving, all right. Lou, but you promised! No, but you said! No, she promised me! No, but you said I was your little Me lady. too! Well, now that everything's back to normal, you can start filling up all those holes. <laughs> you wanted to be on your own? Well, fine. Hmm. Oh, yeah. 